cymbals, you can apply live effects to cymbals in Illustrator, CS5, CS4, PC, Mac, etc. So now I've got some cymbals here, cymbals palette, window cymbals, and I've opened the library already, but you open them via the right side menu, open symbol library, and other library. Of course, you can also open them from here. Now you could use any other symbol you can find on the web or ones you created. So now with that symbol, just quickly drag that over, just select that one. And now the symbol appears in the, the actual documents symbols library there. And now you can go to the effect menu and say, there's lots of effects. Of course you can apply just vector effects, but you can also apply various artistic ones, ones that you would see in the old gallery effects or in Photoshop. So blur, Gaussian blur, just basic standard blur effect. And you click that, apply, and now that effect has been saved there. Now you can create more complicated ones. With the appearance palette, you go to window, appearance, and you've got the Gaussian blur there. Of course, you can add multiple effects. You can, of course, as they're live effects, you can change the blur to something else or remove the blur completely. You can of course also go to the window graphic styles and save the style via the right side menu. New graphic style, just save it, click OK, and that's saved. So that's a quick and easy way to apply live effects to symbols. Now if you change the design, obviously just change with it. So you can actually modify the design of course, you can also edit the symbol at this point. So if you wish to go to back to edit the definition. So you can change, say, aspects of the, well, the colour. So I'm just going to quickly change the colour. And change that colour so to red. And now exit out. And as soon as you do that, the live effect, which again, like I say, is live and can be changed, changed quickly, changes the symbol and changes the colour there.